the usual standard settings. Then scroll down and find an item that concerns privacy protection. Usually you can tell by this icon if you have a standard theme. There is also a regular privacy. Don't get it mixed up, because many people can't find it later. Then click here and scroll down here. Find special features. By the way, it tells us at the bottom that we must control all these settings ourselves. That is, no one but us should do this. But by default, unfortunately, there are a lot of different functions, they are turned off or on, so you need to double check them yourself. Go here, scroll down here and find unlimited mobile internet. Look here, you will have a lot of applications. That is, in principle, all the applications that exist. First, you need to click on the three dots here and click Show System Processes. Then everything will load, you will see the application where you have the slider turned off. There will be applications where there is no slider at all, and they will also come across where you have everything turned on. Now listen carefully. You need to selectively select those applications that are slowing down for you. That is, what is meant? Well, for example, YouTube was slowing down for me, that is, it was working really badly, some videos were loading poorly, although the internet was good. So I turned on this slider, and now everything really flies. For example, if you play some online games, then you can also make such a slider on the game. And again, everything will work fine via mobile internet. That is, here selectively, perhaps your messengers are slowing down, perhaps some other applications. If, for example, you do not have such a slider that can be turned on or off. Here I am just showing an example on some application. Well, for example, I go here, press this slider. We have another slider below. We also press it. We go back with the arrow. And you see, opposite the application, a slider like this has already appeared. We can turn it off or on. I would also advise you to find these two applications, which are called downloads. Usually, they are turned off in everyone in this way. That is, you need to activate them. They specifically manage downloads via your smartphone. That is, for example, when you download some games, when you download something from Google Play, when you download something from the browser and the speed is not enough for you.